barristers will say that they cross-examine through pickpocketing and the witness will not know that they've had their pocket picked. Until. Until. And it's very different. You know, when I was when I was studying law, I remember being taught about the cross-examination of the blood specialist in the Chamberlain case. And there was an aha moment in the courtroom that we all got taught as law students because the barrister had been briefed so effectively by his instructing blood specialist that he realised when he was taking the cross-examination from the blood specialist on the stand that he hadn't followed the procedure to identify fetal haemoglobin as compared to adult haemoglobin. And it was that moment where the whole courtroom went, oh. So I think there's also a difference between the criminal and the, the and, you know, there, there have not been criminal trials in Queensland since March and they'll be opening up later this month and New South Wales has started a little earlier than us. So it's... it's well, they say justice delayed, just justice denied or whatever the saying goes. It's... But I think a lot of people, particularly in those um, contested criminal matters, want to wait until they're standing there. Mm. They don't want their justice to be remote. Mm. I think it might be different in most construction cases, but, for example, a very volatile relationship between two construction parties. I think a lot of our clients will say to us, I want to be in the room. I want to stand there and I want to watch, I want to watch her lie to you. Mm. And so it will depend upon our, what our witnesses, what our clients are saying and how they want it dealt with.